Okay. Well, um, thing update. We went to a local aquarium, a uh, fish store today, um, and we asked them for, you know, hey, can you test this? What do you think's wrong with it? Carbonate hardness. Um, the highest that this test will go up to is a 14. The reason why it doesn't go above 14 is because you don't want anything higher than 12. I tested this. That water is the pure mineral water and the salt, nothing else. You know, no bicarb and no marine buffer. It is just the, the salt and the water that gave a reading of 26. As in, almost double the max on the chart. Yeah, there's a reason why um, these didn't do very well. And having a carbonate hardness literally that high, it, that's one of them. Um, hopefully the only thing wrong with it. So we're going to get that sorted out and uh, go from there. So... Um, the way you do that is fairly simple. It's, um... Okay, apparently your phone doesn't vibrate to plug it in and are recording a video. Um, yeah, so the reason why is mainly the salt. Turns out there are two types. Salt water, salt, obviously. There are types for normal water and for reverse osmosis water. RO water is pure. 
it is 100% water, nothing else. We aren't using <laughs> pure water. Our water already has minerals in there, hence the name mineral water. The issue is we were using salt designed for RO water. And so we were adding minerals to an already mineralized water. And we, you know, that is not good. Um, already it was That's not a good start, let alone adding in the extra sodium bicarbonate and the buffer solution. So yeah, that's why um, we now need to either find, well we need more salt either way, and it's, are we going to get for mineral water and just go down all the sailors and get another fucking van load of mineral water bowls or are we gonna go get a fuckload of RO water bowls and stick with the salt we currently have um, I'm waiting on a reply from the local fish store that we went to um, I really wish it had a sort of generic name, <laughs> um, but it doesn't, it's literally, it's just city name, aquatics, and it's like, yeah, no, I'd rather not just give away where I live that easily, um, but yeah, I'm waiting on the, them to get back to me, you know, sort of what would be better to go with. Um, but yeah, hopefully that was the issue, and we'll get it sorted. But that, that fucking, just, the, the trip today to that store was painful, if I'm being, we're being honest, since last Sunday, it has been fucking painful. It's like, my diet is just... It just doesn't want to fucking listen. At all. Or he's like, you know saying the most obvious shit and it's like you know that there have been many times this week where he has sort of interrupted you know um, one of the times this week he was asking oh how you know how are the crabs and I'm like Mm, they're still not looking that good and then he you know I'm about to go and say and those two that we put in there that were walking around fairly sure that has died and he just starts fucking talking over me and he's like but I don't understand how the thing can like the two can live and it's like if you just fucking shut up and let me speak and finish trying to say something, and let's be perfectly real, I know more about this than you do, so, you know, maybe you want to let me finish what I'm saying before you, you know, go off talking about random shit, and it's like, especially in the fucking, in the fucking fish store today, it was just, oh god. Because obviously, it was 
me and him and the woman doing the tests. Last time, it was the same woman that did the nitrite test. Last time, he was like, oh, I'll let you, you know, go tell her everything, all that sort of stuff. And that was fine, because I was like, you know, here's what we've done, you know, tanks died cycling, at this, um, you know, on this day, um, you know, the, the ammonia cycle finished this day, and sort of saying, you know, here's all the details type of thing. And then it was very easy for the woman to say, yep, no, you, you're fine type thing. Whereas, today he didn't. Today, instead of letting, you know, me, the person that is doing literally 99% of the work for the tank, and, you know, knows about the tank is second-hand from me. Everything that he knows is just what I have told him. And so, you're essentially playing a game of fucking Chinese whispers when I'm here. And is just like not letting me speak and it's like what the fuck are you doing such an arsehole sometimes and it's like you know <laughs> he's standing there sort of essentially next to me and he's like oh he did this he did that and it's like if you just let me speak, I could tell her myself. And it's like, you know, because, you know, I'm not socially retarded enough to sort of be completely unaware of my surroundings. You know, I'm not going to start a fucking shouting match in someone's store. You know, especially as a, like, grown up, you know, if I was like a child it might be excusable, but I'm not going to fucking stand in their store and start having a fucking shouting match with them, and it's just like, telling her what I would have told her anyway, but instead of just letting me tell her, he tells her, and then he's like, is that right? And it's like, <laughs> why? What the fuck is wrong with you? You know, rather than sort of tell her what you think is right, and then ask me for confirmation, you know, I'm, I'm a big boy, I can speak on my own, and it's a woman that we've already spoken to a fair bit in a fish store. It's not like I'm on the stage in front of thousands of people and I'm like nervous and shit. It's like it's literally just a random woman. <laughs> That's it. So, you know, I can speak for myself, and it would be a lot quicker and simpler if I did. And it's just... I don't get it. But yeah, he's also, um, one of the things that is really annoying, um, you know, for me, is he has no spatial awareness. 
it's like the only thing that exist in his world are the things that he can see in front of him. You know, if he can't see it, it doesn't exist. And he's just fucking standing in doorways. And it's like... Business. You are using up this employee's time and not being charged. Right? It was a free water test. They didn't charge us for it. Sure, they made a you know, profit by selling us the uh, KH tester. But the actual time, you know, <laughs> they didn't. They didn't charge us for that. They didn't charge us for using their testers or anything. And so, you know, like, the least you can do is not stand in the way. The least you can do is not block the other employees from doing their job. But he's just like, nope, I'm going to stand in the fucking doorway. And it's, it's like, how do you do that? He does it, he does it in the fucking store as well. You know, he'll like, you know, there's like aisles and stuff. He will... And there, sorry, there's like things on the end of the aisle. He will like he will either leave leave the trolley or the shopping cart even. He will like either leave it. Um, oh, I don't know what's the word. You've got like the aisles and then the bit that goes between them. If that makes sense, you know, like aisles go this way and then there's like that this one he will leave he will see something on the end of the aisle and he will leave the car blocking this this direction thing or he will either leave it like the aisles like here like the actual bit with the food on and he will leave the trolley, like, here. And so, you've got, like, the two aisles, and part of it is just, part of the entrance to it is just taken up because he's fucking left the shopping cart there. And it's like, how, how do you do that? I, I don't get it. It's like, I don't understand how you can be so just oblivious of everything. Sometimes I end up standing in, you know, in the way of things. But it's like, if I do that, I am aware that I am doing it, and it's just because there's no room anywhere else. <laughs> there was... Oh, God. Um, last Friday. I, um... Complete fucking retard moment, honestly. Um, we were walking down to the, the this one um, at Marx's. Um, I, I was sort of walking down it, um, and it's like at the end of the store. And so instead of having like aisles and stuff, it just opens up into a big open space. And I, I was walking on the left. And, and I wanted to sort of go, you know, like, around uh, type thing. Yeah, I think. But that there was a guy sort of in the open area. There was a guy sort of next to the end of the aisle. And so I sort of stopped. Um... <laughs> I, I stopped um, to say, you know, I want to go where you're standing, you know, you go wherever. And he did the same thing. And we <laughs> we did that thing. 
where you both go to move at the exact same time. <laughs> And we both, we both did, um, oh, and I, I forget exactly how it happened, but I, I ended up sort of going, no, that was it, because I wanted to go right anyway. Um, I think, yeah, I think I wanted to go right. And so he, he wanted to go, sort of, I think. Did he? I can't remember, honestly. I, I think he wanted to just go straight past the sort of <laughs> you know, you've got you've got this middle bit and he's like at the end of two aisles. And he just wanted to sort of go like that. But like <laughs> I thought we both thought we were letting each other go. And so, I I start moving, and I and I'm still thinking that he wants to sort of come into the cross bit, and so I'm like, oh, I'll just you know keep going right, <laughs> and he has the same idea, and we just sort of both awkwardly like walk <laughs> walk off together. And we're both just saying sorry constantly at each other. I oh, got it's kind of hard to explain, but <laughs> we both just like went at the same time. And we were just like we have no idea what the other person is doing. And it was, oh god, it was the most fucking awkward shit possible. <laughs> oh god, but yeah. That was interesting. I've still got a mango to eat. I've got two of them, actually. Um, I don't know if the knife is sharpened currently. i got two of them. Two mango. Um, I kind of hate how they did it. It's like, you can get a single mango for a pound and they've got like a box of loose single mangoes and you pick whichever one you want for a pound but then they've also got underneath it they've got mangoes in a two pack and obviously you can't sell the loose two packs of mangoes that's just two loose mangoes and so the um are like, you know, in plastic and all that sort of excess junk, but it's like, I have no choice because all of the other ones are really unripe, um, and that, like, all of them are roughly about the same ripeness, and I'm like, I don't want that, and so it's like, they're also a bit small, and so I'm like, I kind of want to anyway. But it's like, I don't want two that are going to be ripe at the same time. And so there's this two pack, and it's got one that looks a bit riper than the other. And I'm like, okay, I'll have that one. And it's like, oh yeah, um, right, that's, you know, more needless um, plastic waste and it's like one mango was a pound and then two mangoes is two quid and it's like <laughs> I want to take the loose ones I don't want this extra fucking packaging but it's like I have no choice because it's the only one that's about the ripeness that I want um so yeah, I've got that to eat tomorrow, and then probably Wednesday as well. It's always fun. I like mangoes. And stuff. I like. So 
sound so fucking dumb, <laughs> I know, but still. Um, but yeah, so, oh, I guess computer update. I mean, the last computer update was yesterday. I have beaten, oh, well, actually, that is something, um, I genuinely, I, um, so my dad woke, woke me up, basically, by texting me, um, he was like, I'll be home in 30 minutes, get ready, and I'm like, okay, one, I am not going to be ready in 30 minutes at all, and it's like, I was genuinely still sleeping at that point, because for whatever fucking reason, well, no it's not, it's because Friday I um, had that fucking one and a half litres of pina colada, and then because of that, I didn't really sleep much. Um, you know, I got to sleep like a couple hours later than normal. And so when I woke up on Saturday, I was still kind of tired. And I also, you know, I felt my stomach feel a bit, a bit off. You know, I feel a bit sick. And so Saturday, yesterday, I slept for way more, <laughs> you know, I slept for like four hours in the afternoon, and so yesterday night, I'm like, I've already sleeping a fair, you know, I've already slept a fair bit today, and so I wasn't really that tired, and so I was just awake all night, and I genuinely, I got to sleep at about 7am, and obviously, if you get to sleep at 7am, you're then having to deal with, um, you know, all of the daytime shit going on. You know, you've got the sun coming up and all that sort of stuff, and all the extra noise it's going to make. And so, yeah, I got to sleep at 7 and got up at 2, which is, what, 7 hours, I think. It's like, yeah, though I got those seven hours of sleep, I woke up several times during that. You know, I woke up, because I checked my phone each time I did, I woke up at about eight-ish, and then ten-ish, and then about one-ish as well. And so... While I did get seven hours of sleep, it wasn't a very good sleep because I was just constantly waking up. And so I, you know, I was basically sleeping all night, sorry, all morning. Um, and then we got in. And then it's just kind of like, I can't really be fucked to do computer stuff today. <laughs> Honestly, it's like, we got in and it's like half four. And it's just, oh, can't be fucked. And so, I still haven't. Um, the main thing is just still, I have no fucking clue about the motherboard. Like, every single one of them is just being a dick basically it's like none of them tell you is this out of the box compatible with you know the high end you know most used um sorry not most used but you know if you are spending a lot on a CPU, and you want 
and you know your motherboard is fairly expensive compared to the, to the rest um it's like you know why aren't you making it clear is this thing compatible out of the box and it's like just fucking tell me and it's like yeah um so, yeah fun and i don't know enough about computers and it's just oh god Um, as soon as we get that motherboard issue sorted out, that should be, you know, good to go. Um, I'll ask around online, um, do all that sort of stuff. I haven't even looked at any computer stuff today. Um, yeah, that's everything, I think.